So this is the all new SkyTrack Plus, one of the most anticipated launch monitors and simulators of the year. Now the original SkyTrack came out in 2014 and sold over 70,000 units, making it the most popular launch monitor out there. And in today's video, we're gonna unbox it, take you all the features and settings to see if this really is the best launch monitor of the year. So let's do this. So the SkyTrack Plus comes in at $2,995, but what do you get with it? Well, you get the SkyTrack Plus unit, a USB to USB-C cable, a USB-C to USB-C cable, a USB-C wall adapter, and for an extra $99, you can also purchase a protective case, which I would highly recommend to get. So SkyTrack comes with three different software plans. Now you have the basic software, and this version is included with your launch monitor. Now this contains a fully functional practice range, and there's really no subscription required. Now for $99 a year, you can get what's called the Game Improvement Plan. And the Game Improvement Plan increases the functionality of your launch monitor with giving you bag mapping, a wedge matrix, skills assessment, shop optimizer, and shot history. This also allows for integration with their simulation partners, including E6 Connect, the Golf Club 2019, Creative Golf, Fitness, and more. Now for $199 a year, you can get the Play and Improve Plan. And what this gives you is everything in the game improvement plan, but you also get WGT by Topgolf. Now Skytrek also has what's called the new PIP program, which is an amazing simulator package. So for $249 a year, you can get either 15 E6 and 15 WGT courses for your iOS device, or you can get 15 E6 courses for your PC. So you really have a lot of options when it comes to what plan works best for you. So what's really great about the SkyTrack Plus is that it's compatible with multiple systems. So you can use it on any mobile device, either iOS or Android, and it can be used with your Windows PC. Now the SkyTrack Plus has been completely redesigned, giving you both a dual Doppler radar and a photometric camera system. The improved photometric camera system gives golfers highly accurate and reliable tracking data for improved indoor and outdoor performance. So now you can work on your game at the range with your SkyTrack Plus. And the new Doppler radar system delivers useful club data, including ball speed, launch angle, backspin, side spin, side angle, carry distance, rollout and total distance, distance offline, club head speed, angle of descent, and 3D flight path. And what's really cool is it has new club data, including smash factor, club path, face angle, face to path, and face to target which really just blows my mind. And this is all displayed on the new and improved shop optimizer interface. Now, the way this system works is that there's a red, yellow, and green scoring system that lets you know how close your numbers are to the best players in the world. And this new interface also houses information tutorials from Golf Digest number 22 teacher in the world, Nick Clearwater. So with all this amazing tech combined with the new SkyTrack Plus, it gives you roughly 40% a larger hitting area to give you more flexibility to capture a full range of your shots, a new onboard processor for faster shot to show ability, as well as easy and secure connectivity to a wide range of PC and mobile devices, an added five gigahertz Wi-Fi capability for faster and more stable connectivity when you're in the Wi-Fi range, USB type C charging options, a long battery life, and my favorite, you don't need any special balls or stickers needed on your clubs to get reliable data. But what I love most about the SkyTrack Plus is that it's so easy to set up and you really don't need a lot of room to use it. Practically, as long as you have enough room to safely swing a golf club, you're going to have enough room to use your SkyTrack system. Once you connect to the system, you'll see a red laser pointing on the ground. And all you have to do is place the ball on the laser and you're ready to go. So now we know more about this amazing unit, let's hit some shots and play with it. But before doing so, I want to say big thanks to our friends at PlayBear.com. They're huge supporters of our show and our community, and because of them, we're one of the first to get our hands on the SkyTrack Plus to share it with you. So if you're interested in the SkyTrack Plus, there's links down below to pre-order it right now. It is slated to be released on May 19th, but there is a good chance it may sell out, like what's been happening with the other units in the past month. So don't wait if you want one, and be sure to check out the links below. Okay, so everything's all set up right now for us. And what we're gonna do is we're going to go to hit a pitching wedge first. So it's right here, and hit pitching wedge. You wanna make sure you have it on pitching wedge down here um, because it won't give you the correct numbers. Now, one thing I really like, if you guys kinda of wanna see how this is set up now, is they have a shot detail. And you go right here, you click on that. And this is really, really, really cool. Um, first of all, in the upper right hand corner, you see what the cursor is. Um, this is gonna show a heat map of where the ball actually lands, which is super sick. Um, it also just shows face to target and club path here, um, and it's it's pretty dead accurate. 
And then here, the color coding system, um, as we were kind of talking about earlier, it shows you kind of how you're doing in terms of numbers and where you should be. So if it's red, it's way off of where it should be. Yellow is not as bad and green is your right on point to where the system is saying you should be on your kind of shot. So it's really cool this feature. So again, if you want to kind of reduce it, you just close it down and you can get this screen where it shows just the basic info. But if you click here, it opens all this information up so you can actually see it. All right, so the first thing we're gonna hit is the pitching wedge. What's really cool about the SkyTrack Plus is you can use any ball you want. So we don't have to use like an RCT ball, an RPT ball. But let's go ahead and hit some shots and see how these numbers kind of come out and we kind of talk about some of the features here. All right, so hit that kind of little fat. And what you can kind of see here is it's not quite uh, an optimal range in the backspin. It's only showing 4350. It should be about seven to 9,000 on the backspin, which I didn't get, which is true because I did hit the ground behind the ball and therefore I didn't get any spin. Um, I also only hit the ball 97 yards. My pitching wedge is about 20 yards less than I normally do. But you can see in the upper right-hand corner, it's actually showing us where the ball landed. It's a heat map in green. What's really cool, look at the face of target and club path. I mean, that that's exactly where I've been hitting for the last two, three weeks, it's right? And it's happening again here, I can see it. And that, that looks dead on, but let's go ahead and another shot. All right, so it should be a lot better here. Yeah, see, so that's about normal for me. All right, so in the second shot, I hit definitely solid. You know, like I said earlier, my carriage is about 120. Here it is 122. Um, my backspin was about 65, 87. It's saying optimal should be about 81, 100 to 9,500. So that's why it's in the red. Uh, I, I am in the optimal range for my descent angle. Um, ball speed is 94, club speed is 80. And what I really think is neat, again, is you can see the heat map, right? You can see it new, it's brightly white, whitish green where the ball landed. This is an offline by eight yards. Um, and it actually shows you where the ball is struck um, on the club and why it's kind of off a little bit as you see there with the face to target and club path which you know off by a little bit going right and here's another cool feature too um, is the shot optimization if you look down the lower right hand corner you see where it says shot score 18 shots left so if we hit 18 more shots with this club it's gonna start calculating and knowing how I really hit this club and start helping us get better by using AI, using data to figure out exactly where we're at and what we need to do to get our game better. So that's, we have 18 shots left. I'm not gonna take 18 shots of the pitching wedge, but that's a really cool feature. Let's get one more. Yeah, so on this third and final shot, you know, again, the carry is 118. I was saying it's about 120. You see it's orange right now in both launch angle and descent angle, showing that I'm not in the optimal range. And you know, I'm still trying to get my shot dialed in. Um, and as you can tell, I'm not getting the right launch angle fully as what I should be getting with the pitching wedge. Now the backspin's off by a little bit too, and that's why it's in red. And what I th like I said earlier, what I think is so neat is that heat map and seeing where the ball lands. And you kind of see where you're kind of really hitting it at. Um, and get bigger and smaller depending on the club. Again, face the target club path, straight on. But, you know, I have 17 more shots left here with the pitching wedge, which I'm not gonna do to get that um, shot optimization score. But, I mean, look how beautiful and crisp this looks. I mean, this looks real. I mean, look at the clouds. And if you guys notice, these clouds actually move um, real slowly. So it looks like a real range. I mean, this is probably one of the best ranges I've seen in, in any system right now which is the basic system. So a huge plus with the SkyTrack Plus in terms of the way it looks, um, straight out of the box with no extra added features set. And I mean, I love the new technology that's built in this thing. It's just, it's just amazing. So big thanks to our friends Indoor Golf Design for letting us do the amazing Indoor Golf Simulator. To be honest, I'm just blown away with the SkyTrack Plus. I mean, for a little under $3,000, you get a full functioning simulator and launch monitor that can play up to 100,000 golf courses. So I'd highly recommend for you guys to check it out this golf season. But what do you guys think of the SkyTrack Plus? Now, if you guys want to see what we thought of the Mevo Plus, the biggest competitor to the SkyTrack Plus, then check out this video right here where we put the test. And I'll see you in the next video.